Hello children, hope you all are fine. So let us start our studies. Take out your language textbook. Chapter number 3, the sentence. Page number 11. Now my dear students, before doing this, you have to know what is a sentence. So, a sentence is when we speak or write, we use words. We generally use these words in groups. Like, Rohan is a boy. So, a group of words like this, which makes complete sense, is called a sentence. Now, let us start from your book. Read the group of words given below. Rohan boy, he brother, he loves play football. So, here the sentences are not complete. These sentences are not making complete sense. So, we cannot say these words like a sentence. Now, do they make any sense? No, not at all. Now, read these sentences. Rohan is a boy, full stop. He is my brother, full stop. He loves to play football. Each group of words makes complete sense here. Why? Because before writing a sentence, you should keep three things in your mind. That a word should always begin with a capital letter. It should end with a full stop. Or if it is a question, then it should end with a question mark. So you have to remember these three rules. Now we will do some structures which is given in page 11 and 12. Let us do A. Put a tick against those which are sentences and a cross against those which are not. Number 1. Rohan loves to play. Is it a sentence? Yes. Then give a tick. Why? Because it is beginning with a capital letter. Rohan. R is capital. And ending with a full stop. Number two. It is cold today. Put a tick. Because it is beginning with capital letter. Ending with this full stop. Number three. Live in a house, beginning with small letter, no full stop, incomplete sentence, so it is not a sentence, so put a cross. Number four, the girls are playing with the ball, full stop. It is also beginning with the capital letter, so it is a sentence, put a tick. Number five, was very proud, no full stop, it is incomplete so, it cannot be a sentence. So, put a cross here. Number six, in the morning. Not a complete sentence. No capital letter, no full stop. So, put a cross. B. Rearrange each group of words to make a complete sentence. Number one. My beautiful is dress. The words are not in order. So, you have to rearrange. What is the correct answer? What will be the complete sentence? My dress is beautiful. M Y my M will be capital and then you have to put a full stop. Then only it will become a complete sense. Number two. Their months year in are a uh, 12. There are 12 months in a year. Three. The stars at night twinkle. The stars twinkle at night. Number four, the children in the park playing are. The children are playing in the park. Full stop. Next is C. Match the sentences with the correct pictures. Here some pictures are given. A flower vase, car, sleeping baby, smiling joker, crawling baby and the picture of a Taj Mahal. Now you have to match these sentences with these pictures write down the numbers here in the empty circle number one 
the baby is crawling to the taj mahal is in agra 3 there are many flowers in the vase 4 maya is sleeping 5 i have a big car and 6 the clown is smiling now you start writing these answers in your book at first you try to write on your own if you have any problem you can refer these answers from this page so complete your work take care god bless you thank you